the first thing that we should try to do is to find the equation of this line that passes through B and T because we already know that to find this area of the shaded region we can just simply use integration to find this area then minus the area of this trapezium over here which I have all the information that I've needed except OB so to find OB we will need to first find the equation of this line that passes through DP so let's first try to find the gradient of this line and to do that we will differentiate this curve so y is equal to 8 over 3x plus 2 we can rewrite this as 3x plus 2 to the power of minus 1 so dy dx is going to be equal to 8 of minus 1 3x plus 2 to the power of minus 2 times 3 chain rule and this is equal to minus 24 over 3x plus 2 square so now at this point p the x coordinate is equal to 2 that will give us dy dx so at point p dy dx will be equal to minus 24 over 3 times x which is 2 plus 2 square so dy dx here is equal to minus 3 over 8 and this will give us the gradient of the line that passes through bp so now we can form the equation of this line equation of the line that passes through bp will be y minus referencing it to p y minus the y coordinate of p which is 1 is equal to the gradient of x minus the x coordinate of p which is 2 so y is equal to minus 3 over 8 x plus 7 over 4 and b is the y intercept of this line so 7 over 4 here this tells me that point b is 0 and 7 over 4 so to find the area what we will do is we will try to use integration to first find the area of this region between the curve and the x-axis all the way until this point here p so from here until here the x coordinate of here is zero the x coordinate which is the x coordinate of p is two so we will first use integration to find this area then I'll minus away this trapezium that I see over here. So for this trapezium, we'll use half times height times sum of parallel sides. So the height is going to be this distance here, which means that it's from here to here, which is going to be the x coordinate of P. So 2. This length here is the y coordinate of P. So it is 1 and OB which is 7 over 4 is going to represent this length here so this is 7 over 4 so the area will be integrating from 0 to 2 of the curve which is 8 over 3x plus 2 minus away the area of the trapezium half times height times sum of parallel sides and this is going to be 8 of integrating this ln of modulus of 3x plus 2 divided by 3 from 0 to 2 minus away this this is 11 over 4 so we have uh, 8 over 3 substituting 2 in we have 3 times 2 plus 2 it is going to be ln 8 so ln 8 minus away substituting 0 in we have a 8 over 3 of ln 2 and minus 11 over 4 so the area is going to be equal to 8 over 3 of ln 8 divided by 2 so ln 4 minus 11 over 4 